video that Ed took back in 1990, and I'm going to show it to you. It's best probably to look at this thing in the pitch black. So I hope you enjoy it. Um, this will be the first time it's ever been shown uh, for free anywhere in a public forum. Don't know who the white lady is or, or what she wanted to tell Ed or tell anyone. But here it is, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to put it on right now. 1760. In that video, Ed Warren was standing right here. I just matched up the shots. He was standing right there, which I'm gonna walk over. Right, right here. There's the entrance when you come in. And he was aiming right there. You could tell by these two graves and that monument right there. And then when he pans, this grave stands out, it says Kent. As well as... White Lady uh, has often been seen in and around Union Graveyard, Route 59, and as far over as Stephanie Graveyard in Monroe. But we've been getting reports uh, for the past 20 some years of people who claim that they've seen a lady in white going along you know, on the road out there in the cemetery and Lorraine and I decided that since all these reports were coming in, that we would investigate it. And I stayed in that graveyard for seven nights. I'd leave the house around midnight. I'd go to the graveyard in my van, park the van, and I'd open up the doors. It was hot, it was July, August. Uh, actually, this was August. Yeah, it was the end of July, I'd honey, the van to sit back first and I'd see all these ghost lights flitting all over the place. And I thought, sooner or later, something's going to happen. And on September 1st of 1990, I believe it was, mm -hmm. at... Uh, 2.40 in the morning, 2 40 you told in me. the morning, that's right. I'm sitting there and I could see all these lights over near the Baptist Cemetery, all around the stone wall. And all these thousands and millions of insects were just chirping away. All of a sudden things started to quiet down. And I could hear what sounded like a woman weeping. I picked up my camera, I had a camcorder alongside of me, and I had the tripod set up outside. I didn't want to leave the camera out there because of the humidity. I took the camera out and I could see all these ghost lights suddenly forming into a figure mm -hmm. out of a woman. Now, the film that I took of of this spirit. Looks as though it's very far away. Actually, it was very close to me. It wasn't that very far away. And I put the camera up to my eye and I let it go and I couldn't see anything. I took my eye away and I could see her. I immediately put the camera on the tripod and let it run. And I started to walk toward her as she was coming towards me. Mm -hmm. And she disappeared. Many people know about the stories of Ed and Lorraine Warren, like Annabelle, 
the Amityville Haunting, uh, the Haunting in Connecticut, and of course the Conjuring franchise. One that's not too popular, or well known I should say, is the Lady in White. The Lady in White was something that happened to a, a man named Rod. Rod was driving home from his job at Home Depot and he was passing along this route right behind me, right here where all these cars are going. Uh, when I had my experience with the white lady, I think it was a month or two before yeah. you got her on film. Mm -hmm. I was coming home from work. I was working in Fairfield at the time and it was about 12, 30, 1 o'clock in the morning. I'm driving home. I'd just gotten off of work. I was wide awake, all wound up and uh, got up to Sport Hill Road in 59 where it crosses. There was a slight mist on the road. Mm -hmm. The road was a little damp and, you know, fog about maybe a foot high, yeah. which wasn't unusual for the area. Uh, got up, came up the hill a little bit, and as I came up the hill coming up past the cemetery, I felt like someone was on my right side. Mm -hmm. and I looked over and there was a person, just like Ed sitting here, that solid, sitting there and on a little brown scrunched up hat and a little scruff on his face. At the time I had no hair on my face, I was clean shaving at the time. So it definitely wasn't my reflection in the window. Well, I did one of those, looked forward, looked back. That figure was gone and in front of me, I'd say a good 60, 70 feet in front of me, there was a woman standing in the road. Mm -hmm. I, I tapped on the brakes, I didn't jam them on because mm -hmm. the road was a little slick. Okay. And as soon as I tapped on the brakes, she went from about 70 feet out to right in front of the car, and the thing that I remember the most was her hand came up in a motion like that, like up and that way, sort of like she was not trying to grab me, but she was reaching out. Mm -hmm. He makes it home, and he wakes up his wife, and he's crying hysterically because he says he felt all her emotions. Now that footage of Ed doing the investigation here, he came here seven nights investigating and waiting with his camcorder. He had one of those old VHS camcorders. So he would come here a few hours a night or overnight and stay and investigate. And on the seventh night, he caught that apparition of the woman in white. I'm gonna try to find out exactly where that was. I have a feeling it was over this way and she was passing this way. So if you look in the video, it very well could be that monument right there, or even this one here. But I'm gonna take a walk around and see if I can find it. All right, I'm gonna walk by myself down to the back of the cemetery here. I like to get a feeling, go off alone at first, get a feel for the place, and then do the investigation. So, right now I'm pretty much in the back, pretty much in the back of the cemetery now. And like I said, I just want to get a feeling, get a feel for the place. It's, it's very foggy out. It's rainy, gloomy. I love it. Do you like rainy, gloomy days? Walking through cemeteries, paranormal investigating? Watching movies, perhaps? Or do you like hot summer days out in the blistering sun, feeling nauseous and sweaty? I don't know. Comment down below. Now, of course, in a little while, we will be doing an investigation. Trisha and John are going to join us today. Raina couldn't make it. Um, it's a very popular cemetery here, Union Cemetery. A lot of things happened here. And this is, this is Ed and Lorraine Warren's stomping ground. As a matter of fact, they are buried three miles away. And I will go visit their grave on my way back. It's always good to pay respects to you know, the head honchos of paranormal. The man and woman who pretty much started it all. It's a nice river down here. Nice little creek.
nice creek down here. You call it a creek or a crick? Or a brook? Is that a brook? I don't know. I'm gonna call it a creek. It's a nice cemetery. It's a good size. It's not huge. It's not at all hard to search around. Now I was just walking in the back there. I was showing you the creek, creek, brook, whatever you call it. Standing back there and trying to get a feel for this place. It's very calm here. You know, sometimes you go to a place you can tell, you can feel it. I don't I don't so much feel anything here. So we think that this is the spot in the footage of Ed Warren. We think that the white lady was walking in and out of these graves here and he was standing up over here maybe somewhere, up in the back or front, where in the back. And we think she was walking over here. So we're gonna start right here. We're gonna do an EVP burr session and see what we get. All right, so I have out the digital voice recorder. I'm gonna turn it on and I'm gonna place it right here on this grave and we're gonna see if we can catch anything. You guys wanna ask questions too? Jesus. Speak so loud. Talk to us. You can light up this ball and see that you're here. Or the dog. You just have to touch the doggy's head. Just and said something. Look, we're here. Look, we're here. Where, where are you? Where are you? Are you here? What's your name? I want one of those sounds. Blue eyes. Blue eyes. Never gotten that response before. Yeah. Any of us have blue eyes? I have green. Jen has green. I have blue. I have brown. 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 Maybe the they have blue eyes. eyes. Maybe they do. The dog has blue eyes. Oh, the dog. You're right. The oh dog gosh, does light up blue. Are you talking about the dog? If you light up the dog, like, touch the dog like this, his eyes do light up blue. Or purple. I'm not sure if it's purple or blue. It's so low. Yeah, you can see the eyes lighting up. Yeah. Maybe that's what it meant by blue eyes. That's crazy. Yeah. It's so low. I don't know what's wrong with this dog. It definitely needs to be in a dark room. Yeah, to really okay. show the potential. It's off. So. Okay. Ethel came here. Ethel? Are you so of course we have the Spirit Talker app going, because why not? So I'll do another digital voice recorder session, uh, EVP burst session, and we'll see if the Spirit Talker relates to what I'm catching. Let's try this. Here's a Franklin. That's a Franklin? Oh, wow. And it said Frank on the digital yeah. voice recorder, yeah? Or the, no, the Spirit Talker. Yeah. Ethel, so you see it says, Frank, look, we're here. Blue eyes and Ethel. It says 1700s, and I think this was, I think this was built in 1700s because I, I thought in the video Ed Warren said that. Really? I think he said he was reading the sign. 1760. I think I have something on audio. Where are you? Can you tell me where you're at? We're hiding. We're hiding. We're hiding. We're hiding. Listen to this. No. Let me go back. So right here, watch. Right here. Tell me if you hear like whispering. Can you tell me where you're at? Can you give me a sign to let me know where you're at? Oh, I did. What's that? Is yeah. that right there? Yeah. Huh. Evelyn. It said Evelyn? Mine says Evelyn. It just says Evelyn. Oh my 
And she's Sean. with us. Sean. It just said Evelyn. Wow. It just said Evelyn. Whoa. What the fuck? So I think it says thank you so much. It's that's my first thought. Thank you so much. Spirit Talker app. Just what, ask what, what year it is. It said cabin on this one. What year did you die? Can you tell me that? What year is it for you? That's crazy. It said Evelyn, and, and exactly of course she's with us today. Crazy. No babysitter. Like as I was walking up with her. With her. Uh -huh. Wow. Do you know that Evelyn's here? Can you see Evelyn? To you? Can you kind of give me a direction? Do I go straight, back, left, or right? Can you tell me how to find you? Look at this. Wow. It was just going crazy. Right here. Look at it. It's going off. Hello? I picked up the brake. <laughs> and it's and a it break. said brake. Is it brake or B R A K E? Somebody no, here? Like and it sounded like it said brake. Is somebody here? Box. I said get the spear box. Wow, you said, you said spirit wow. box, yeah? Yes, talk Are to you still box. here? Right here. Look at it. It's going off. Is somebody standing Share right here with message. us? Share my message. What is your message? Oh, wow, look at this. Tell us your message. This is going crazy. Look at that. Is it this? Not at all. No, it's not very sensitive. Oh, your though. phone. Okay, but I'm not by But you weren't near it, no. Phone. Right here. Whoa, whoa. It's going up to red. Wow, that's a lot of Look at that, yeah. That's a lot. Wow. Do you want to talk to us? We can hear you. If you want to talk to us, we can hear you. Some voice came through right there. I just heard that. It's like Paul or something, maybe? Yeah, or, or no, or something. Hello. Are, are you the woman in the white dress? Eight. What does eight mean? Is Look at eight? this. Wow. Whose name is on I think it just said Dale. Whoa, well, right here. Whoa. You see it? I this? heard something whisper. You know what's funny is when that goes off, this goes off. Wow, this thing, I've never seen this go so crazy. Might be hard to see in the sunlight. Wow. Okay. Whoa, look at this okay. thing. John? Oh, I heard John. John? <laughs> Can you say Jenna or Trisha? It was, no, I won't. It was saying something. It said no, I won't. Is there something here? I'm gonna set this ball right here. If you can touch that ball. Yeah, right in the shade so you can see it. Yep. And turn it, if you touch it, it'll go off and have make different colors. Can you touch? Let us rest. Let us rest? Oh my God. Whoa, you yeah. think we're bothering somebody? I don't know. Are we bothering you over here? Children can speak to us too. Please go right and that's where we're going. Please go right. That's what, I'm sorry. So down further that way? Yep. Let's try down there. Remember left, I was asking right. earlier, do you oh want God. me to go left, right? I, I was asking earlier, where do you want me to go? Do you want me to go left, right? You did. Straight or forward? To you? Can you kind of give me a direction? Do I go straight, back, left, or right? And it, it says right. It takes a while to communicate. Exactly. Maybe they have to build up the energy to get it out. Yes, because that was the biggest thing is us not waiting long enough yep. for them to respond. Wonderful. Which is true. Wonderful. Wonderful. I got, Wonderful. I got it. I got it. I got it. I get it now. It said the children wanted to speak. Did Dale? the children want to speak to us? Why are you talking to this? Oh, oh I don't know. 
Yeah. Some people do. Some people do talk into I it. Do. I do. I, I love know. you so It's much. like a walkie-talkie. <laughs> Can you hear me? Mayday, mayday. Ten four. Ten four. Rubber ducky. <laughs> calling all spirits. Calling all spirits. I can't. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna take the SB7. I'm gonna walk around and see what voices are coming through. So much has happened already. This is crazy. I'm done, sounded like. I love the SB7. I've had such good experience with it. Um, I try to make sense of what they're saying and see if it correlates with what's going on. Watch out. I'm gonna try something else. Let's see if they can read. Do me a favor. All right, spirits, tell me, what does this grave say? What's the name? What flag is this? American. What happened? Oh, oh my gosh, I got Hold on, something happened. Something just happened with Trisha and Jenna. Let's go find out. So, Hall came up on the spirit talk. Hall? Hall. 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 Hall? Like Hall. Uh, and I she, said, we stumbled upon this. And I said, Mr. I said, Mr. Mr. Mrs. or Mrs. Uh, Hall, where are you? Uh, and it's right here. Right it here. says it, this is me. This is me. Oh my god, really? Oh my gosh. Esther I Hall. Was hung. Wait, did it say, it said Esther earlier? Yes. Yes. Oh Esther shit. Hall is I here. Have John. <laughs> you hear oh, all this? It no. said Esther earlier. <laughs> Ethel. I just heard. Or Esther. What does this say? What did it say? He's over there. He? Arthur. It said he's over there? Yeah, we need Arthur. Arthur. Arthur Hall? I just saw it. Arthur? Why, yeah, it says Arthur? Arthur around here. I just saw and I Arthur. said, where's Arthur? And she just, just got... It. Arthur Hall? If there is, is one of these guys Arthur that's a Hall? I believe so. I, just I think swear, we, I I think we I figured it out. Down. It's Arthur Hall. Or Rose and Rosemary. Arthur and Rosemary. We need to find an Arthur and Rosemary. Can you light that up if you're Arthur? Thank you. Arthur, can you see us? Yes? All right, stop touching the lights. Do you know the white lady? Who's the lady in the white dress? Oh, you do know her. Whoa! Where is everybody? John's over there. This thing's going crazy, you guys. And it's not my phone, see? Elsewhere. This just said elsewhere. Do you want me to leave? Yes? Can you stop touching that? Let go. Back up, back up. Are you angry I'm telling you to be back up? Wow, look how crazy that's going. I'm gonna try SB7 again. Do me a favor. What does this name say? What's this name say?
restaurant, said John L. Perry. Let's go meet up with the others. See if they've caught anything. Now just three miles down the road is where we were. We're now back at Stepney or Mar Monroe, Connecticut in the Stepney Cemetery. I think I got that wrong the first time I was here visiting Ed and Lorraine Warren. That's where we're heading now. And I'm gonna I'm gonna leave a little gift for them. Nice little gift sticker. You can imagine if anybody's gonna try to come through, it's gonna be Ed and Lorraine Warren, right? Let's try it and see what happens. Right? Torch. Torch. Edward and Lorraine, I'm leaving you a spirit ball. So you can, um... What did you say? It just said some... Oh, was that... Did you just put it there? Thank you. Oh, yes. wow. I left you a spirit really? ball. Mm -hmm. And it said I'll prove I'm here. Yeah. Wow. I left you that spirit ball so you have colors in front of your uh, tombstone. You you have... There it um, goes again. Oh, it's oh, going off again. Wow. Great job. Thank you so much. Thank you for setting that off and letting me know you're here. All right, so well, please move back. So I put it move, back. And move back. Wow. Oh, Where it's going off again. Wow. Thank you. That's freaking awesome. Those don't just go off randomly no, either. Though no. you have to physically have touch, to touch those. It. So it's Lorraine not one of those where you can um, go like. There it is. All right, like so it's off. Above it, it, you have to literally touch you it. You have to touch it. Lorraine. So it, there uh, we go. There Thank you. I you wanna... know, Lorraine and Edward, this is what we use now uh, for, we use this Detecting, when we yeah. uh, look for spirits. What you're setting off or somebody's setting off in front of your tombstone, that is what we use Look now. at that. So I thought it would be cool to set it in front of you so you can see what we use now. I can't believe that's going off. Yeah. Wow. I know, it just Somebody's going. touching it. All right, when it shuts off, please don't touch it. Well. Ed, if it's you, can you touch it? Patience, it said. Patience. It said patience. 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 Wow. Lorraine, if it's you, can you touch it? Play. Play. Oh, you want to play with the ball? Oh, oh my God. God! And it went off. Wow. Awesome. This is cool. Yeah. Wow. This I'm is glad we neat. did this on the spur. We could on a whim. possibly be yeah. recording yes. us interacting with them. Yes. No, it stopped again. It stopped. It's not going off. All right, okay. Lorraine, can you? Sorry, okay. Lorraine, can you please move it? Use whatever energy you need from us. Ed. Oh, okay, oh Lorraine. God. Okay, it is Lorraine. Because I Whoa. said Ed right when it went on. I have the chills. Because we have followed their work, their evidence, Since the story. Yeah. His, His voice. voice. Yes, I'm here. Yes, oh, I'm here. Yes, I'm here. Hi, Lorraine. Hi, Lorraine. I got Lorraine, it's like so nice to meet you, Lorraine. We are such big fans. Wow. Lorraine, are you enjoying this right now? If you are, can you light up the ball? Yes. Wow. This is <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Great job. And it's been sitting there not even lit up for, not, like a, for a while. Minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Literally right after yep. I said that. <laughs> and now awesome. it's, it's off again. So let's it's off see again. I have the chills and it's not because it's a SB7. I'm going to set this right here and you can actually talk to us through this as well as the, the lighting up the ball. Does anybody want to talk to us? SB7. That was weird. That went on long. Mm -hmm. I will talk to you, it oh said. What Definitely is your need name? Those speakers. Can you tell me your name? Now. 
No. No. Over here. Over here. Over here. Nell, are you 17? Is that what you're saying? Absolutely. Absolutely. <gasps> oh. Hi, Nell. Were you the one touching the ball? Nell, if that is you, can you touch the ball again? Did you join us? Can you light the ball up again, Nell, if you're here? Said something right there. Okay. No, I didn't know. Okay. Oh. It doesn't go. We're gonna have to just listen to it. Hi, Lorraine. Did you hear that? I heard something. Are we friends? We're here to. Yes. We, we are we, friends. We are friends. My name is Jenna. My name is Dale. Frank again. again. Frank again. My name is Trisha. I'm John. Frank, you're not allowed to follow us. I said it. Help. Help, maybe, yeah. Uh... What was what was the name of the doll that you guys used to have? The Raggedy Ann doll. What was her name? Nothing really on this. What was that? I have to listen to that again. It, it did something weird. Is there somebody that wants to do Oh, the EMF detector. Okay. The EMF. Look at that. Oh, you're standing right next. Oh, hi. Wow. Thanks, your presence known. What does it say? I know you. I know you? Who's here with us? How do we know you? Can you, can you step over here? Can you step away from oh, there? Up there it goes. There it is. Wow. Thank you. Great job. Harry. Thank you for touching that. Everyone's out riding today. Mm -hmm. All right, Do you so need my help? If you need my help, you can light up the ball. Can I help you? The ball can be very interesting. It's got really cool colors. The EMF just went to orange. Oh, really? Oh, there oh, goes the ball. Thank you. I appreciate wow. it. And it's going off the same time. Thank you. I hope you're recording that. Oh, yeah. That is amazing. They're both going off at the same time. Thank you for touching that. Tell me who's over here with us. Robert. Roberts. Roberts. It gave you a name. There's the ball again. Yeah. The ball's wow. going off again. Do you get a lot of visitors because of Ed and Lorraine? Yep. Wow. Your face. Your face? My your face. What about my face? What about my face? Spray, spray, spray. Back. You are not. Oh, you are not allowed to follow us. Yeah. Cannot follow Nobody us. Follow me. You want to stay here, Jenna? You want to spray her? Yep. It smells good, actually. That's I like that smell. It's like a lemon. Yeah, it's like a lavender. Yeah, lavender, lemon. Yeah. Not to follow Evelyn That's all either. negative energies. You are to stay here. And for those wondering what this is. Trisha brought this. This is a spray. It says blocks negative energy, helps, protects, and gets rid of bad vibes. You want me to spray your back? Oh. Did you spray yours? No. Yeah, I sprayed myself. Can you spray my back? Plus, I have a bracelet that I wear. Okay, it protects you? Yep. Good. All right, guys, that's going to cut it for today's episode. Hopefully, you enjoyed this one because I know we did. A lot of cool stuff was caught. Now, we're going to go grab something to eat. And remember, Stay spooky. Peace.